All right, so there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. What I did was basically, it was a little trickery, but it looks like we have a physical drive now and it's accessible. So when I load up Windows Explorer, you can see the USB drive, the folder is empty. We have successfully fixed this partition manager What we're going to be talking about is recovering a USB drive after DD. Um, and I'll go right into it. What is DD mode? DD stands for data duplicator, which is to make a copy using block by block from one device into another device. DD mode writes the image to the drive in a native raw manner, which will cause the drive to no longer be visible in Windows Explorer. The drive is unrecognizable by windows so when i go to plug this drive in what are we going to get well let's see just give me a second here and i'll plug it right in and we'll get some error messages and it says the directory is invalid so it's, it looks like it's a broken thumb drive, wouldn't you say? All right, so that's okay. We're not gonna do anything at this moment. We're gonna hold off because what we have to do is we have to fix it. And it is fixable. It's not like your drive is permanently damaged or done. Let's go forward with this. What we're gonna need is we have the USB stick in DD mode. I also found the software that potentially fix this for us and it's free and it's called active at partition manager so we're going to download this and we're going to make it happen for us so i'm going to open up a browser window All right, there we go. I know I misspelled it, but that's the beautiful part. So I'm gonna download the software. We're gonna set it up. Yes, allow. We'll install the program. Just like this, I accept the agreement. Let's install in default place. We'll go ahead and launch the partition active active partition manager. Here. And I'll go to disk image management. get some uh, pop-ups and stuff like that. I'm just gonna cancel because I kind of have an idea of what I want to do. So what we're looking at here is the drive, physical drive one is the drive in which we want to fix. It has basically, um, it's, it's not readable by Windows as you saw earlier. But we're going to take a look at this and we're going to see what we can do with it. Okay, so as we see down here, new primary partition will be created starting from the 2048 sector with a size of 7.6 gigabytes. Drive letter will not be assigned and partition will not be set as active. Volume will not be formatted. So create partition successful on physical drive one. Now what can we do?
All right, so there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. What I did was basically, it was a little trickery, but it looks like we have a physical drive now and it's accessible. So when I load up Windows Explorer, you can see the USB drive, the folder is empty. We have successfully fixed this partition manager because we had to use the format features of Windows Explorer's disk management tool in combination with the advanced features of Active Partition Manager to clean up the disk a little bit, format the disk, and get it working again. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to say thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please click the like, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and thank you, and have a great day.